Um, are you all there? Mm, yeah, I'm back for now. I don't know what happened. Hi, good morning, afternoon, evening. Yeah, it was apparently, um, I swear to God, if this internet goes right back down, I'm gonna quit and be like, you know what? That's my sign to go do some other shit than be online. Um, hi. I don't know what happened. Let us all cross fingers that it was a very temporary outage. Y'all. I'm just tweeting that I'm live. Um, so, we're back. And what I was saying before, uh, before we lost the internets, it is. the inter Well, the internet's evil anyway. So we're back. I don't know what that was about. Um, no, unsure. I'm just me and my coffee. I got coffee, that's what I know. What I was saying before I realized the internet was down. We, we actually got a question on, on a Coffee with Cypher form. Oh no, did the kitty leave? Hey Techno, good morning, good morning. We're back, brief interruption cause internet. Um, not sure what happened there, but I was talking to air apparently. Um, oh, 2K, stop teasing me with all your sales. Um, oh, XCOM is half off though. For anyone who's wanted to get an XCOM. Alright, that is not spam. Oh. Wow. Wow, Trom. Wow. Wow. I'm never going to live that down, am I? I'm never going to be able to live that down, am I? You see friend where? Oh, me. Don't give me that, that, that pleading cat emote. I swear. Well, it would make... Oh, me. Question, can you actually see me with the hat on? Right? I was like, no, not again. Well, I didn't know because it, the internet still said I was connected for a long time before it finally was like, oh, there's no internet. Well, I normally don't wear hats on stream, but White Knight gave me this, so I wanted to wear it, at least for a while. And I'm wearing my St. Jude hoodie. Um, I don't know if you, how much of it you can see, but this is the hoodie I earned for fundraising. No, it's, it's not going to work. It's a very cute kitty. Um, I'm an only child. I'm an only child, those looks don't work on me. Yeah. I mean it's a it's a it's a little baggy though. I mean granted I like my hoodie's a little baggy, but Oh wow, Techno. Yeah, Misty Misty's giving away a purse or a wallet that she made. I think if she hits fifteen thousand, it was gonna be all three were giveaways. Um A 
Okay. I don't give a fuck. Sorry. Oh, wow. Do you have a photo tech now? Because I'm trying to remember if I've seen a photo of you. Whoa. Apparently, I can't eat or drink. So, good job, me. Can you see the coffee spot? No. I have a zip up or pullover hoodie for Social Justice Paladin. Um, but I just spilled coffee on myself. So. Um, I'm going to go change shirts because apparently I can't eat or drink today. And then we're going to talk about Christmas giveaways and then I will uh, address the question I just got on the form because it's a good question, but I'd like, uh, like people to come in and get settled. But yeah, it's not even a white shirt and it's like apparently I have a hole in my mouth somewhere. So I'm just going to leave you for a second. I'm going to start the music because it actually, I forgot to turn pretzel back on. So I'm going to be back in like a minute because I have 8 million fucking t-shirts. Um, I would wear my division shirt, but I want to wear that when I go, go preview the division. So hang on for a second. I will be RB. nothing only me how are you oh is it nice weather where you are oh no oh the emote okay brain brain hey taser how are you oh no not finals the whole I've got a drinking problem airplane running gag comes to mind. That's legit. Oh, I'm sorry. Is there anything we can do? It is transgender pride. The T and the P are capital. Pastel. I woke up like this. I don't, even, I, I don't know what that weird little hiccup was. I better be careful before I get a TOS violation. Yeah, they are universals. Can someone do exclamation twitch unity? I think I have all the emotes now in that in that command. Hi Taylor, welcome. I think you are are new to the stream. This is gonna be me like that emote that we're getting done. Just I have a lot of hair, it's work. Unity, thank you. I feel like this is my Kigurumi. <laughs> I'm not, it's not a dark, well, it's not black or red, but I, I do have, actually, um, a, fuck, what is it? Malvin got it for me. That that is a Sith Lord outfit, and I wore it to see Nine Inch Nails with her. Um, it's a uh, oh okay. 
I was just like, that's a new name. I'm cozy. Oh, I know. I'm just like, I mean, I am kind of a Sith Lord, but. So, rando question before we get into the one submitted question. Um, look in the Discord. I think Bodhi managed to save them as some kind of graphic. Oh, uh, Vaping Grandma. <laughs> I mean, if you can figure out a way to use them or find higher resolution. Um, okay, I, I look like... Um... J-Rock is still playing Resident Evil, like the first one. Um, I feel like we're going to summon Malevent with this conversation. So, rando question. I often view myself as kind of, um, as more, um, morally amb ambiguous. Ambiguous? Ambiguous? Ambiguous is not a word. Ambiguous. When it comes to, like, characters I play, I often do gray things. Um, like, my, my paladin, for instance. Um, she's not a strictly paladin of the light. She's motivated by revenge. And guilt. Which I've realized is a big theme and stuff that I write and do. Um... How do you all see me in terms of, um, like, because whenever I say I'm a, I'm a Slytherin, one of my friends would be like, no, no, you're not a Slytherin. You're so like a Gryffindor or a Hufflepuff. And I'm like, I always saw Hufflepuff is like super, yes, charity. Thank you. We need to add that. Um... Thank you for the reminder, Savava. Charity bits, that is correct. Oh, I messed that up. Dag nabbit. Yay, bits. Um, oh, good. It actually does that it automatically. Yay. Um, let me send a reminder on my tweet as well because of... I forgot about bits. Right, but every time I talk about... Um, Um, in any stream, add charity when giving bits in 20% is, 20% is donated. Details here. There we go. Ha ha. Yes, pastel. Well, it's like I don't see myself as a as a helpful puff. Well, that's the thing. So, a lot of times when characters are are seen as evil, it is because of how the text, not the subtext, um, Let's see. 
There's a custom charity cheer mode, apparently, but I can't cheer in my own channel. Where's the charity cheer mode? Oh, I don't see it in J Rocks. I don't know if he has charity in his in his title. True. It's the light blue one. Yeah, but I I can't cheer in my own channel, so it doesn't I don't even get to see the options, Savava. I was I have J Rock open in another tab and oh I see I see. You be like how are you cheering and you're not here? Oh nice, that is so cute. And if you use it, it automatically adds the charity. Aw, thank you socks. Hey, tunnel clubs. So, I'm still trying, I need to change the alerts. I'm sure J-Rock is like, how are you here and streaming? Yay, BMTEL, charity bits. Like, how are you on? Thank you all for the bits. Thank you all so much. Oh shit, Techno! Well, thank you. Holy shit. And, and that's the alert apparently for 1000 bits. Well, shit. I feel bad because I, I I jokingly told J Rock to add me as a mod one day because he had like no mods. Um, the bot's on. Oh, you know what? Maybe the bot isn't on. It is on. Uh. All right. Let me close the bot and reopen it. Welcome back. Hold on. Let me uh, start the bot again. I guess losing internet fucked with it. Because it was showing is on and showing me live. Charity bits. All the charity bits. Um, I like how in whispers are like, don't share passwords. Um, so if you do, so if you click on the bit icon, um, in the chat bar. All right, now let's see if this will work. Yay, it worked. Um, it, um, so do exclamation charity, or if you click on the little bit icon, there's a blue one. And it'll automatically add the hashtag for you. And so 20 cents of all the bit, 20% of the bit donations will go toward charity and the specific charity. You're not a noob. Um, so here it is. Holiday season of giving. Um, you'll also unlock. So basically it's a way for us to do something good. It's low effort. Uh, that... There you go. So, Socks, can you make that a command or do I have to do it in... <laughs> Hold on. This can be anyone. Haha. -ha. Um, there will be a cooldown though. A two minute cooldown. Socks hit exclamation charity again. So yes, all the charity. Um, and let me turn down the crock pot because I can smell. Uh, 
I can smell the chili and it's gonna distract me and make me super hungry. So whenever I get up, I need to turn down the crock pot. Yeah, we were talking about paladins. Um, what I was saying is how do you all view me? Like a lot of people when I talk about um, like I'm a Slytherin or whatever, I was gonna no, you're not a Slytherin, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, okay. Yeah, this is the chili I made like days ago in the crock pot. And I was gonna make I was gonna make some yellow curry, but I will be gone for three days. Well three and a half. Two and a half really. <sighs> Yay bits. Thank you, Ten. So, uh, to explain bits and cheering. So let's say Hey, Belle, thank you for the bits again. Um, so the way the bits and cheering work, let's say you really like a streamer. Yay, bit. Bit fight. All the bits. Um, so let's say you like a streamer, maybe money's tight, what have you. Or like you like them, but maybe, you know, for a reason your prime sub is somewhere else. Or just you like them, but you don't like them enough to subscribe. And that's fair. There's a lot of people I watch I can't afford to subscribe to. And I like them. I just don't like them quite enough to subscribe. Um, you can say, hey, here's a hundred bits. Here's a thousand bits. If you really got money, let's say you want to do a one-time thing and don't want to do a donation, you can say, here's 5,000 bits, whatever. Um, so it's a way to tip without giving money. And then every month when we're paid or every 45 days if you're an affiliate, that is rolled into your revenue. Oh, hey, Battlefield 5 is updated. Um, I got Battlefield 5 as well for my friend who works at EA. So if anyone's playing on PC, um, oh my God, I can't just move this. Move. Um, so yeah, it's a way to show appreciation for the streamer, like if money's tight so, um, if I, let's say money was super tight and I didn't have anything, I could, I could say, yes, I'll watch ads for bits. There's Twitch RPG, which lets you do surveys and things like that for bits. Um, hey, as a queen, good morning. I was just explaining, uh, bits and charity because until the 27th, you can cheer with bits and the streamer keeps all their revenue, but then charity also benefits. Oh lord, is that the one that's like really, really hyper caffeinated? Hey Belle, thanks for the host. Okay, let me let me quickly turn down the crock pot because I can smell that chili and it's going to distract me. Hey socks. Yes. Welcome back, Trace. And anyone that was here right at the start, my internet dropped, which is why it dropped and came back. So that's why it's a little weird. Oh, is it? How how strong is it? All right, so sit still. I'll be right back, and then we'll talk about Christmas giveaways, and then for really real, we'll talk about the question I got. It on the form. I also tried to straighten up a little bit behind me, but as you can see, that green box is still there. Thank you. Um, I have no room in my bedroom for any of these, and I figured the stream waited. Um, the Discord pillow was from the partner party. The Assassin's Creed Odyssey helmet move was from E3. And the dog is from, um, the boomer is from the Far Cry event I went to earlier in the year. Yeah, I got that from my friend that worked at Microsoft at the time. Yeah. Oh, you saw Genki? Hi, Genki. What you doing? I already changed shirts once. I'm not picking you up yet. 
it's actually kind of hard bell it's got a core foam a foam core um it's it's actually kind of hard i had to stuff it in a piece of luggage when uh alex gave it to me <laughs> i was like oh um it's not a hard yes Like it is, it is still soft. I can still. Oh god, I have a big ass. Um, you can still press in a bit, but it is, it is kind of hefty. I don't know if you can hear that. Hey, Bran. Oh Godzilla, I found my beanie baby dragon the other day. Um. Well, I if I had a two bedroom, the se the second bedroom, um. No, not ASMR. I was just saying, like, you can tell how dense it is. Can I... Taser, you stream too, right? Yeah, I have a couple Beanie Babies sitting around. I'm looking at one right now on top of my entertainment center. I want the Snorlax plush, but I really have nowhere to put it. Can I get a shout out for Taser as well? Did you see the story about the dude who bought the Snorlax beanie, beanbag thing and then the odyssey he had getting it home because he bought it when he was like in, in Japan? You're welcome. Ooh, Chef John Reed is on and I know he will make me hungry. You're so welcome. There's a giant Snorlax you can buy. Hold on, I'll see if I can find it on Amazon. Snorlax beanbag chair. This thing, well, one is three hundred and forty-five dollars. Um, so even even if I had the room and did not have a cat that would make it, like, um, its bed or pee on it, because Genki's getting old, he has accidents. Um. I like how it's twelve ninety nine for shipping. Um, actually, that reminds me, I need to pay off my Amazon credit card whenever we get paid from Twitch. I'm hoping it's tomorrow. It's, I'm hoping it's Friday. Oh, because I'm a petty asshole. Because I'm a totally petty asshole. You're so welcome, Taser. You know, I try to I try to make sure folks who stream are acknowledged. Who saw this tweet? Oh no, Prince. I've gotten a few. I've occasionally found a a centipede or two, and I'm like, nope, because everyone would hear me scream if I picked up something and a centipede or some shit crawled out. Like, I wouldn't... That thing's 93-inch bear. I'm afraid to ask how much this thing costs, Socks. How much does it cost? Because there's no price on this thing. I'm sorry, scorpions? Scorpions. So, two hundred ninety U.S. dollars. Nah, that's that's in the same realm as as the Snorlax. Lord, that's a who the fuck do you think you are question? But it was four in the morning on my phone when I saw it, and I was like, Oh no, I'm sorry, it was last night. I think. Oh no. I'm so sorry, Prince. Mm. But but let's talk about that tweet though. Who the fuck? Who the entire fuck? I know I sound like an owl. Thought that that was okay. I need to know. 
And also looking at the at the channel at the timeline, I'm pretty sure that's a bot. That does not seem like a real live human being that would ask that question. Hey, Kaylin. But it's just like, excuse you, Freud. Who the fuck are you? I was just. What t what's the timestamp on that on that tweet? Oh, it was last night. I felt I felt like it was twenty years later. Oh, that's right. One second. <laughs> Sorry, the game that I played, Book of Demons, uh, the embargo, the, the like press embargo, um, lifts tomorrow. Or lives like tonight at midnight so I'm gonna get a review up before I go well I was like I'm tired And that was the context of me saying that, honey bunny. Oh no, Kaylin, I'm so sorry. Um, did they tell you all how to cook the shabu shabu? Cause that is the danger of it since you cook it yourself. I mean, you all can feel free to go at that person. I ain't gonna stop you. I'm just saying I said my piece, but I was tired. And I know, I'm pretty sure because I think I've muted that whole conversation, was... I'm sure someone I'm like, but you said this shit on Twitter, of course I can ask you. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's very thin meat and it doesn't take long to cook, but there's some things where it's like, no, make sure, like, leave it for so many minutes, blah, blah, blah. Um, so there's a place at Brandon. Good morning, Blurred Bites. How are you? Oh my god, that is such a cute little emote. Yes, please. Uh, yeah, Kaylin had some shabu shabu last night. Oh, okay, is the shrimp? It's so maybe the shrimp wasn't fully cooked. Blurda, have you been here before? You're. I'm trying to remember, or are you like Ty Taylor and uh, renamed yourself? And oh my god, that is such a cute emote. Do you stream too? <laughs> Oh, you're on BGG. Oh, Jay is on? Isn't it like still work hours over in the UK? Uh, Kaylin, do you mind sharing, um... Oh, okay, okay. Thank you. That is so cute. Um, Shabu Shabu is like kind of cook it yourself, but uh, Kaylin has a tweet. What command? Uh, you can't do the command taser, only mods can do shout outs. There are certain commands that are mod only. Yeah, so unless you're a moderator, yeah. Oh, and it sucks, but you can do it. Yeah, most of the time a shout out command is not going to be everyone to do it because you'd have randos coming in shouting themselves out. Oh my god! Why does the doggo have. Is that the super cute puppy that you shared? 
in in Discord. <laughs> oh, the pupper. No, I mean for a lot of t I mean so VIPs, subs and regulars should be able to post links. The what I found is that Nightbot and Streamlabs bot will conflict. Um, but let me double check and make sure you're a Nightbot. Aha, that fixed it. It you were regular in one spot, not the other. Yeah, it's amazing, Bell. I should text Brandon and be like, you want to get some Shabu Shabu after the show on Sunday? <laughs> Although it can be super expensive too, depending on what you get. It's almost like tapas. I was like, this shit's delicious, but then you look at the bill when it comes, you're like, oh. That, that's not a sale, XCOM. I want this Viglio Confido mug, although y'all know I don't need any more mugs in this house. Oh, nice. Um, no, because there's, like, you can get just meat. Um, I'm sorry, honey bunny. So, like, you can do veggies. You So, like, at least the one I know that I've gone to recently with Brandon. Um, like, you could do an all meat. You could do, like beef there's pork there's shrimp um right brand there was the ironically the topless place in my neighborhood did not last which is kind of surprising oh mussels i didn't know you could do mussels at shabu shabu although i normally don't do seafood there i'm still iffy on shrimp at shabu shabu because landlocked what kind of land like uh, yes. I've not heard that in years, but I do know what Joy is. It's cheap until you add it up. <laughs> yeah. I mean, if I was in, like, Boston or on the West Coast and did Shabu Shabu, absolutely give me all the shrimp. Iberico's still around, but Iberico, it's like... Y'all need to have the come to Jesus talk with your friends before you go to Iberico because somebody will order a pitcher of margaritas or um, sangria or somebody will order like, oh, I just got like the potato or whatever it is because it's like five bites maybe depending on what you get. Well, it's like you get the sangria but you all agree about the bill when it comes. Because I've had that uncomfortable moment where we've gone to Iberico and then it's like, ooh, the bill. Mm. And you see the people who are like, I didn't drink nothing. Hey, thank you for the sub, nothing only me. Thank you. Um, oh, speaking of subscribers, and then I swear we're going to answer this question or at least try to answer it. Um... Yay, socks! You are able to do the unemployment stuff. I'm excited. Hopefully they don't fuck you around anymore. Ow, sorry. I need to wash my hair, but basically washing my hair is a is a full-time job, and I really need, like, a second pair of hands. Um, so for those that did not see it, I got um, the draft from... I got the draft from Rabbit on the emotes. I will never eat at Applebee's again. I ate there a couple times, and the second time I ate there, it's all good. Thank you for following. I need to fix the, uh, I still need to fix the Streamlabs command for, um, oh, thank you. Well, no worries, nothing, only me. T did you all see Genki? Hey, Samwife. Genki. Oh, shit, he came when I called him. Thick-cut bologna on toast and a bag of chips. 
I'm not already sent life. Wow, that that was called lunch for me back in the day. Um. Oh. Yay, bits and taser. Just so you know, um, you can do charity hashtag charity. Um. Oh, okay. Genki is wandering around. He's actually sitting right next to me. Boo, work. Um, I'm just saying boo because I'm annoyed. Um, but it's baloney. Explain this to me. It's baloney. Like Oscar Mayer baloney is cheap. Thank you. So I'm getting all of them done. We are super, super close to a new emote. The only thing is if I get <laughs> if I get a new emote slot, um, I have to put a placeholder in it before it drops back down. Um, although I look today, it looks like if you unlock that slot, you don't lose it. Oh, look, I grew up on government cheese. Which is why sometimes... No, he's just sitting here. And now he's got his back to me. Look, can we talk about that fucking tweet from the CEO of, of Twitter? That was like, I went and stayed in this tiny cabin. And I reaffirmed my whatever with nature and, and something else. Oh, no, I'm... I, so... I don't know if you can see it. There's a bag of Cheetos behind me. Normally, I hate Cheetos, mostly because they make a mess, but also I had to, yeah, that bullshit. Um, mostly it was like socks. We broke. This is what we can afford. Of course he was. He's the white tech bro savior that thinks he's going to spare all of us. No, I didn't have a Twitter. No, I did have a Twitter account. No. I didn't join Twitter till 2007 or 2008. I didn't know Twitter had been a while, around that long. Of course. Right, Techno? Right. And it's just like, the whole idea. Oh, okay. I didn't. I thought Twitter was maybe 10 or 11 years old. Um, I know Facebook was a thing that got created because of people <laughs> um I missed something oh sorry I moved the admin channel the admin server that was me I forgot I got one of those you've been on Twitter since things and I think it was 2007. <laughs> well, that would make sense, Pastel. Like those people like, I'm going to go pretend to be on food stamps for a whole week and oh my god, I don't know how people live this way and yet you do the same shit. So, for those that don't know, I grew up on food stamps, like the paper fucking book of food stamps, where you had to go to the store with them. Hey, Tommy, welcome. We're talking about eating the rich. They're probably full of fat and poison, though, and not the good fat. Like, I was a kid at the store with the book of stamps, and, you know, people traded that shit for, for things you couldn't buy with food stamps. So, when I see these people like, oh my god, a link card, I can't go to the store with a link card, I'm like, you try going to the store and discreetly pay with some paper fucking food stamps. You try that. And it's like, oh my god, how dare you get like 80% ground beef because you splurged or you bought a turkey with food stamps. It's still fucking food. And, uh, you know, I'm not sure people's ages in the chat. 
but I lived through the whole welfare queen era, and my mom was one of those people. And granted, I don't have the best relationship with her, but she was one of those people that had to do the work to wel- welfare to work thing. Someone who, at the time, let's see, I'm 45. She would have been at the time I was like in my teens. But she was one of people that was like, you have to prove that you have to literally go and. We're going to try to force you to go work in an office. My mother has no skills. Because she had me going on 21. She went to college, did not finish college. And, uh... She was not... She is not suited for office work. Like, she had a job. But she was one of the people that got let go from the park district illegally, blah, blah, blah. Just suffice to say, at this point in her life, ain't nobody going to hire her, even if she was in good health. Because she's old enough where she would be discriminated against because of her age. I mean, hell, I'm in that category because I'm in my 40s. Um, well, she was one of those people, like, she had to go out of her way. She had to, like, you know, and she was on a cane at this point. Like, she really needs to be in a wheelchair or have surgery at this point now, but. So when I had, what? He Oh, he only got three years? Damn, I thought he'd get more. Um... Well, like this idea that, you know, black women out here having babies just to get rich on welfare. Ain't no rich on welfare. Oh, the first offense. Oh, okay. Well, it's it's Peter pay, Peter robbing to pay Paul. When I worked at Walgreens, there were still customers who talked about welfare fraud. Predominantly white area with lots of rich people. And like the number of people who came by basic necessities on welfare is ridiculous. Oh, shit. He's not going to make it. Why did the music suddenly get very loud? Um. I don't like this song. At least not for a supposedly chill playlist. Um. And now that's too low. Um. Good morning. Look, I mean, I grew up on welfare. I ain't got no shame in it. Um, we were poor as fuck. I'm an only child. My mom was on welfare. Uh, she unsuccessfully tried to get child support. And when I turned 18, they were like, well... Oh shit, I need to mail someone an Xbox controller. I forgot who it was. Because when I go to the post office, it's going to be one of those I hate life. And I have to stand in line because their machine is down. <laughs> Look, welfare fraud is hard to do. Because you. So, has any. Of those of us in the chat that have had to do welfare because I have been on welfare as well but I also had that well you know if you had a kid you could get more and I'm like fucking you I don't want children because I don't want to be saddled with a child I didn't want to get what two hundred dollars more right seven right so but it's always just people that act like because of this bullshit idea that oh people on welfare out here buying like caviar and lobster and shit now here's the thing somebody may have saved up food stamps gone without whatever um and that one time they buy like the nice ground beef they buy one fucking lobster or whatever um good morning Jem. how are you um i mean i was the same thing lilith i had to oh yeah it's totally been that It has never gone away. And probably never will. Oh yeah, Cadillacs. I have not had a car. I did not have a car until friends gave me a car. Oh, that is not fit. I need to push my hair back. Right. But you know, this idea that welfare queens are living on caviar and steak and shit... 
Well, they make it so hard to buy good food on food stamps and WIC. I used to work at Jewel. The, the shit people couldn't buy on WIC was ridiculous. Like, there was more you couldn't buy on WIC than could buy. Wait, hold on, hold on. I'm reading what Prince said. In my country, they decided a person without legs couldn't get money for wheelchair because it wasn't sure they'd never walk again. Because a person without legs is just... Uh, try not to use insane like that, Jay, please. Wick has you eating bullshit. Wait, they started screaming at you? Oh, it was terrible because people, and then the people that were on Wick would feel so bad. Like, when I was a cashier, I mean, we literally would have like a fucking book of what you could and couldn't buy on Wick. And you wouldn't know till people tried to check out and they gave you the Wick or you, whatever it was. Because I was a cashier and we had to sign, like, we had to literally fill that shit out. Like, Yes, they got Similac. Yes, they got whatever. They could only get this cheese. They couldn't get that cheese. Exactly. But oh no, you're not breastfeeding your child or you're not giving your child real milk. Well, Wick won't let you get real milk. Yeah, cheese. Um, yeah, I mean, I, that could be a thing we just talk about for weeks, honestly. Um... <laughs> I mean, to this day, bright yellow cheese freaks me out. Oh, I know, Kaylin. Like, I, I was those people. I had to sign the WIC receipt. You don't get much on WIC at all. Oh, is it? Oh, because they, they, they think anything, basically it's like, and this is what I think about a lot, is that we complain about people being obese, not eating well, etc, etc, on like public assistance. It, oh, Misty, hi! Well, we, we adopt a pet in my channel. <laughs> what would you like to adopt? How are you? Good morning. Um, and I'm Misty, you and I are the same age. I don't know if you have feels or thoughts on this. We're talking about the ways in which, uh, the, the, uh, the ways in which the government, um, treats people when it comes to being on public assistance and the welfare queen myth that many of us grew up with. You know, I have no shame about saying it. I grew up on public assistance. And I was also a cashier, so I would have I would have to deal with the poor people. They just wanted to buy some food for the child. I mean, Reagan brought that Reagan brought that to the fore. My mom had to deal with it. Um, right? I was I was a cashier too, and I would I mean I'd feel bad because I knew how it was to have to be there with a literal book of food stamps and trying to figure out, can I buy this? Can I not buy that? But it was much worse on WIC. Um, can I get a shout out for Imperial Girl, please? Or give yourself a shout out, Misty. Um, morning, Charlie. Um, and thank you for the resub. Misty, you may have pushed us to a new emote, I think. Cause we were four points away last night. Three hundred dollars a month. Oh my god. Maybe. Let's see. I'm gonna check the dashboard. Cause I was literally four points away last night. Three 
We're one point away from a new fucking emote. The problem is, I don't yet have an emote. Ready. Son of a biscuit. Would you see the super cute? Um... Did you see the super cute? <laughs> oh my god, Belle. You gave one one sub. Damn it. I don't I don't have anything ready. Oh uh, shit. Well, we just hit 225. God damn it. Hey Mod Geek, thank you for the sub. Well shit. Uh oh thank you, Misty. Oh my god, you all. Good morning. Thank you. Um, so, minor problem. We don't have an emote to put in the slot. Um, I don't have one ready. So, hold on, since you all outwitted me. Um, yes, I will see you in your channel soon, Misty. Let's see if I can paste it here. Oh, there it is. Before you go, Misty, there are all the emote drafts. Oh, I'm like, shit, I don't have an emote ready. Uh, hey, Alex, good morning. How are you, friend? Well, shit. Uh, fuck. Keep talking. I'm trying to find if I have any draft emotes. Um, anywhere. Oh, you know what? I can use the I Need Diverse Games ones as a placeholder. Mike, no, I'm waiting on, um, I'm just waiting on, um, Rabicoon to give me the finals. Get on what? Well, we have one new emote, so we would need 250 to unlock a second one. Well, no, I'm trying to find one so I can at least keep the slot. Um, crap, where are the emotes? Dag nabbit. Um, keep talking. I am looking for the folder where I saved Rabbit's emotes. Um, I'm gonna upload the rainbow controller for now. Um There's a Genki emote. Well, there will be a Genki emote. Um, so for now, we got uh, Pride. And I checked, we don't actually lose the emote slot, even if we drop in emotes. Oh no, what happened to Freya? Oh no, what happened? Oh, you put a link in the chat. That's why. You should be. Let me change that. You know what? Your old name may be a, a, a regular. So let me update that. Because uh, I don't think Nightbot is smart enough to... No, it says you are already a regular. That's weird. That's... Hold on, I'm in the... It says you already exist as a regular. What was your old twi Twitch name? Yeah, it, I tried to add this one and it said you were already a regular. So let me... Let me delete that one and add your new name. Because it, it read that as your, um, it read that as your current name for some reason. So now you are, okay, that's weird. Maybe I have to refresh it, but I added you back. Well, still. All right, no worries, nothing. Thank you all so much. And thank you, Misty, for uh, tipping us to a new emote. And by the way, the hat I'm wearing is from White Knight. Let 
But yes, and they're in the Twitch, um, um, they're in the Twitch, um, you may have to refresh, no worries, um, let's see, Cypher 1 Pride, um, you may have to refresh for Cypher 1 Pride to show up. For now, it's gonna take place until I get the the emote from Rabbit. So let me see. And it's not a command. What am I doing? Nope, it's not there yet. Nope, it's not showing up yet. And also, we can change the other emotes because apparently you don't lose your slots even if your sub points drop. So if we go down in sub points, I'd still keep the 14 emote slots. So the next goal is 250. All right, let's actually answer the question we got. So, um, can someone do exclamation coffee? It will explain what I'm about to do. Um, so, practical advice question slash topic. How to push through when anxiety starts to choke you out makes it hard to impossible to get anything done? That is the question. Um, so, I refreshed. Cypher 1 Pride is not ready yet, but this is the question I got. It, on the form. Uh, Brand beat you to it. I put it on cooldown, um, but I can change the cooldown as well. Where the hell is it? Um, so... <laughs> This, this is a little hard, um, well, you saw that we'll have a finger guns emote eventually. Yeah, I'm trying to fix it, but I forgot where I put it in, uh, fucking dream lab spot. Um, so that, it's, it's hard because I struggle with that all the time. I struggle with it, um, I struggle with it daily um i would say change up your routine if so if you've got a routine and that's making you feel really stagnant um and you feel like no matter what you do it's like this is what i always do i always get up i get up at the same time i make coffee i do whatever i do like my morning routine change up your routine get up earlier get up a little later um maybe have tea instead of coffee um, but also kind of sit back and, and get out of the house to do it because this is the problem I have. As you can see behind me, it is kind of cluttered because I have stuff to mail out. Um, get out of the house if you can. I know it's not always practical, either due to mobility, location, money, even like going down the street to a coffee shop can sometimes help me get in a better frame of mind. Sit down and think about what do I have to get done? What are small things I can do? Like today I'm going to do, I'm going to mail things. I'm going to spend an hour on email. I'm going to take a break and make sure I eat lunch at a reasonable time. Um, are there people that can help me with this? So like in my case, can I delegate stuff for any diverse games to other people? And uh, Wing Lioness has been amazing in helping with a lot of stuff. Um, you know... Think about what's causing the anxiety. Is it, I've got a deadline and I'm super worried about making the deadline. Is that a thing where if I don't make this deadline, it's like ruinous, whatever. Can I take a break? Like, is there something like I can play a quick game of Overwatch or uh, is there someone I can call? Because sometimes talking to other people, and this is something I struggle with and, and Melvin can confirm if she's still in the chat, is internalizing a lot of stuff 
and not talking to other people can make it worse. Um, I want to make sure that I don't stray from the actual question. Um, and I don't... Um, I don't want it to be like, oh, well, you know, just push through and things will be great. Because some days, like, take a fucking nap, have some tea. Um, within reason, if going out with a friend for a drink and talking about things will help. Oh, shit, we actually lost a follower. Sorry, I looked up and it was gone. Hearthstone. Oh, okay. I mean, it's it's hard. Huh. Sorry. Um, l noticing the drop in followers just kind of threw me off. <laughs> Luckily, you can't go check and see who dropped you. Um... I know it happens. It just, like, meh. Um, and, you know, and depending on who it is and if people have burned you, what have you, um, it's hard to trust and open up. So, um, my anxiety would probably be a lot more manageable with medication, but when I was on medication for anxiety... It was really, really rough. Um, yeah, it just, it always, it just bugs me. That reminds me. Um... Oh, I know. It just normally, it just threw me off because it was a noticeable difference. Sorry. That's possible. That's entirely possible. Um, so point you're having shortness of breath, try to be aware of my posture, not hunch because it restricts your breathing. Not a magic solution, but it can ease and hopefully stop it. And I, for me, it's like, I try to sit back and take, take stock of what is making me anxious. Is it a money thing is it a deadline is it oh i'm traveling tomorrow and i know the travel makes me anxious um which reminds me i should check into my flight speaking of travel which i can do on my phone thankfully um Yeah, sometimes you don't know what it is. Um. It's just one of those things where it's like, it just, it was like, oh, it was a nice round number. And then it dropped. Thanks. Um, I mean, I don't know. For me, it's... Huh, interesting. I would have never thought about that, Bunny. Um, and what Bunny said is, if I'm having a panic attack, I put my thumb over one nostril and press my index finger between my brows. It slows down your heartbeat for some reason when you take long, deep breaths and switch. Um... Welcome back, Kaylin. Um, so yeah, that that's hard because sometimes that anxiety just really.
Yeah, sometimes getting good crowd can work. It's stressful as fuck. No. Um, how much do I want to be in the front of my flight? Oh, you're so welcome, Techno. Um, Misty and a couple other people gave gift subs. Yeah, crying. Oh, look at this. Um, do I want to move enough to spend forty-seven dollars? <laughs> to to sit in first class. I'm sorry, one hundred and fifty dollars to sit in first class. Oh, really, Bran? Shit. But I do want to move up enough to spend forty seven dollars. Um I would well the thing the hard part is the chair I'm sitting in, I'm not spending hundred and forty seven dollars on an hour and a half flight for first class. Um the flight's not that long. Um, I would say hype, uh, not hyper. What is the damn? Um, not hyper X. What is the damn racing chair? Yeah, the flight's like an hour and a half. That's not long enough to justify that cost. Um, yes, DX Racer. I could not think of the name. I want to keep calling it HyperX. That's not it. Sure. Of course, Afraya. That is the question. Hello. Is that a Bob Ross emote? Oh, that's so cute. so cute though but that is the question I don't, it's hard for me um hey Oli, how are you um sorry I'm also trying to pay for this upgrade while we're chatting um it would help if I didn't lay the card flat down I mean, that's good too, Afraya, because I think trying to push through it is sometimes ignoring it. Um, and I just, I can't. Phone, what? Why is my phone trying to make this into... My phone is trying to force my card expiration to the wrong date. Oh, I'm so sorry. Um, Yeah, so I don't know. That's hard because pushing through can sometimes be... Uh, pushing through can be bullshit. And it doesn't actually help. Well, if I'd actually just signed in, that would have helped. No. 
No, I'm not carrying anything diff dangerous. Oh no, I would never read my card number out loud. <laughs> Yay, pre-check is actually on there. Why am I in boarding group four? Never mind. <laughs> yeah, sorry. Speaking of stream gifts, the hat I'm wearing is from uh, White Knight. It was a stream gift. Because I'm an impatient five-year-old, I opened the box since it showed up yesterday. <laughs> but yeah, that is the... Very true, Ten. Very true. Oh, thanks for this for the sub gift, Bell. I keep wanting to put um early Christmas gifts. What do you mean? Okay, weird. It didn't show up for me. Huh. Not much, Sentai. We were talking about the one question I've gotten so far on my uh, my Coffee with Cypher form, in case people did not know that I'm doing that. Um, so I, sometimes if we have topics or don't have topics, because um, what I'm going to try to do is... Um, is do, so... And you're absolutely right, Ten of Clubs. <laughs> Afreya, thank you so much. Y'all are trying to get us to 250 real quick, aren't you? Well, good. I'm very glad, Ten of Clubs. Thank you all for the gift subs. Can I get love and hype in the chat, both for the the new subs and for Afreya and Belle and Misty, who is uh, streaming now, gifting for gifting subs. Is there anything we can do, Ten of Clubs? <laughs> Thank you all so much. And uh, for those of you that have Twitch Prime and don't want to, don't want to, or can't spend a lot of money right now, because um, I know that feel. Um, it feels difficult to talk about because everyone else has so much going on, and I don't want to bring everyone down. Hello, Mojo. Thank you for the follow. Um, I was very lonely and you know, and I'm trying to think of a way to talk about this without minimizing anyone else. Yes. Is there anything we can do? Can we give you virtual, virtual hugs in the chat? Not virtual hugs. Is there anything we can do? Do you need to talk about stuff here or in discord? Or if there's nothing we can do, just know we're thinking about you that we are not, um, that we're not leaving you out alone in socks. We have you too. But I know it's it's different having someone you can call or text versus someone that can come over um, and hang out with you or someone to go talk to, like in person. Socks, you know that you can talk about whatever you need to here. Yes, you just got to give sub, Uli. That is a sickeningly cute emote. And this is how I get suckered into subscribing to so many channels. Uh, is the good, the good ass emotes that people have. But back to the question. Um, back to the question. Yes, that was Genki. Genki meowed. Okay, well, you know that we have you. Please... Let's give some uh, some love to Ten of Clubs. Uh, 
Hey Taylor, um, we were talking about this question I got in my form. Um, yep, that's Genki. Genki, what? Genki just wandering around yelling at this point. He's he's old man yells a cloud. We should make a love emote, a love command. Your, oh, your emotes do work in whispers. Okay. You're so welcome. Oh, let me close this before I buy this fucking mug. I don't need them. Um, yeah, that's the question we're talking about. It's for me. It, it's sometimes just because I'm ornery. Um. Yeah, and that's good, Freya. The hard part is when you don't have someone to do that. It's... Coffee. There we go. Edit. Oh, that's a nine-minute cooldown. Jesus Christ. Why did I do that? There. Coffee. Um, should not have a ten-minute cooldown anymore. It has a two-minute cooldown. Oh, one other thing I get when I hit 250 sub points is another um, lifetime sub. I can actually get one of my bots a lifetime sub, but the problem is you can't get rid of it. Yeah, and you know, and having a partner is not always the best solution because I love, I love my partner. He does not always get it. He really does not always get it. Oh my god, I keep clicking on Echo Gear by mistake on Messi's channel. Um, This question that I got, because I finally got a question... Can you ban D Daniel GMA quickly? Also report them for being an asshole. So apparently at least once every time we do just chatting this shit happens i'm really fucking sick of it um because again i don't think i look particularly masculine i don't look androgynous wearing a hat doesn't make me look more one of the other i'm really fucking sick of it i don't know what board what fucking reddit board you all are coming from but i'm going to find you And actually, let's make a command. Well, it doesn't matter, but that seems to be the new trolley thing. Um, thanks, Kaylin. And thing is, there's no good way to uh, 
um, and it really irritates me. So, but once every time we do this fucking talk show, it happens and I'm getting really annoyed with it. I don't look particularly, I don't know. And it's like, I'm, I'm trying not to let it bother me too much, but it's irritating. It's irritating as fuck. I don't look particularly masculine. There should not be a question. And I'm getting really fucking annoyed. Oh, I know, Kaylin, and, and that's the part that pisses me off, is that one thing is then it's also on screen. They want fucking clips to spread on their shitty Reddit boards. So it just, it annoys me. And the thing for me is I don't want to ever discount or ignore what trans friends go through. Because in that moment, it's inconvenient, it's bothersome, it hurts, but it will never measure up to what um, what you all deal with, especially depending on where you are in your transition, if you are transitioning, not transitioning, out, not out. But it's really fucking infuriating that this seems to be the new thing to troll on Twitch. So, the fuck? And this is one of those things where I sit there and I'm like, why do I keep coming back and doing this? If every stream where we do this, I'm gonna have to deal with this shit. And I can't, in good conscience, tell people, oh, you should stream on Twitch. If this constantly happens, because while Twitch does have real people checking um, your reports and stuff, they can't stop that in the moment. They can't preemptively stop someone from coming in your chat and being an asshole. They can ban them after the fact, but whatever fucking Reddit board y'all are on or weird ass little idea of what you think this channel is or who you think I am, I will find you because I'm really fucking tired of this. So if that means I get more bots or because I retweeted some shit about PewDiePie and his white nationalist shit. Cause that seems to always follow too. If I retweet anything about games or what have you, I uh, cause people do that to yeah, so next time we chat, that's going to be a topic. And if I get up, or, well, it won't be Saturday because my flight back is at 10 a.m. Um, depending on what I have to do tomorrow when I land, we may do talk show and how my internet is in the hotel. Because y'all... And it's irritating. It's just fucking irritating. Because how am I supposed to sit here and tell people, oh, you should stream on Twitch. You should stream. 
I've met great people and blah, 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 and then have shit like this happen. So, yeah. I mean, you all are great, but I mean, the folks that are our regulars or have been around the last month or so know that I've been struggling with wanting to still stream, with wanting to still do this, and not going back to just direct off the PS4 and not deal with shit. And even then, I get the, I can't tell what you are comments, and it's like, I'm playing a fucking game. Do you want to be here or not? Um... And, you know, again. Exactly, Socks. Exactly. But it just seems like it's it's either targeted or... Hey, Prince. No worries. I'm going to wrap up soon because my goal for these Coffee with Cypher is two hours. Because two hours of straight of talking is, is more than enough. We only had a, a little bit of a break because my internet dropped. Um, oh, but I will be talking about this on on the Twitters, etc. Oh, have a nice haircut. Oh, you're welcome. We're, I'm not quite done. I want to I want to talk quickly about Christmas Day. For those of you that may be around on Christmas, don't have anything to do, or you've got time to kill while you are doing stuff, we're going... We, like like there's anyone else who streams here with me. Um, gonna do... I'll be on on Christmas, because for reasons I'm not doing anything with family or friends. Because after my Thanksgiving experience, I'm not going to fucking go to Friends Thanksgiving. Uh, for those that don't know, I went to Friends Thanksgiving after that stream. It was feeling great. Got there, took my coat off, and my friend's kid immediately says to me, You're going to have a baby. And I was like, I got to go. Right now. Whose channel was suspended? Whose channel? Oh, the one that was just here? Oh, nice. Hey, generic nerd. Damn, that was fast. Wow. Hey, Retro City, how are you, friend? Can I get a shout out for Retro City PD? <laughs> you motherfucker, your channel got suspended. Um. Oh, I know. But yeah, that was my Thanksgiving, which is why I came back. Um, well, I reported his hate speech as well. Um, so we're not quite done yet. Have you been streaming? I feel like I've not seen any notifications for you, because I know I have you on my notif notification list. Um, uh, Retro is local-ish to me and awesome. So you should definitely check him out. I need to like call my friend to Twitch and be like, did you look at this? Because I know people at Twitch, but I don't know who viewed the report. I fell asleep at 9 o'clock, depending on when last night was. After I did some Destiny with Malevent, I was asleep. Because I'm the worst. Like 9, 10, whenever I sent that, whenever I replied to that fuck-ass tweet, I went to bed shortly after. But yeah, that was my Thanksgiving after the great stream we had and Dr. B showed up and we had the great fun and started our cult. 
that was the first thing that happened to me. All right, bye, some wife. I'm going to wrap up soon. We're going to go hang out with Misty, who's making cookies. Um, but Christmas Day. So, I, for various reasons, I'm not doing anything on Christmas Day. So, I'm going to give away a C922 webcam. This is one that I bought. Oh, my God, Dre, thank you. Thank you so much. That was so sweet of you. I feel you. I took some time off and I've got travel. So after today, yes, it is a C922 webcam. It's USB, so it doesn't matter who wins it. Um, can I get hype and love in the chat for that donation? Sorry, I, I, can't, I can't do the, oh my God, like I can't do it. Unless one gives me like thousands of dollars, you're never going to see me have the freak out response. Um, but yes, so webcam and it comes with six months of XSplit. So this is one that I bought after I did get the camera that XSplit sent me. So it's a small package. If you're in the US, it'll all send a two or three day priority. If you're international, I may ask for a little help on shipping because it is surprisingly dense for a small box. Um, but yes, yeah, Christmas giveaway is going to be this and a couple things out of loot crates that are not my things. Oh, nice. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to do that. And I've got a couple things from Loot Crate that aren't my jam, but they came in the Loot Crate. So, there's going to be some... Oh, actually, one's right here. Dark Souls pins. They're 8-bit pins. You did. It was December 1st. I wasn't in town, though. Um, so, I don't know. I may keep them. I may not. Because I like Dark Souls, but I don't like Dark Souls. But this is a pin set that was in a loot crate. Thank you so much, Dre. Well, I was in Philadelphia. I missed it, too, so don't feel bad. Um, I've also got a Metal Gear Solid pint glass and a Doom coaster. Oh, that's so cool, Taylor. Um, I would tell if, well, if they come back in... Honestly, you can order off Amazon for $69 and get it the same day. Because I got mine same day I ordered them. Um, where is... Okay, where's the one that XSplit actually sent me? Because, of course, now that I'm looking for it, I can't find it. But XSplit sent me one that came with a little tripod. Hey, Shamar. Yeah, nice. Um, so yeah, there's going to be, there's going to be a couple giveaways. Oh, you were selling it cheaper and you don't have to worry about shipping. How are you, Shamar? Um, we're actually going to end in a, in a little bit cause, uh, I've been on since 10 with a slight break cause my internet went down. Um, but yeah, someone who got reported for being hateful, their channel's gone. Oh yeah, that's cool. I copped a deal and got them on that Black Friday deal. So they were cheap. All right, bye, Brand. I'm gonna stop in a minute because I'm hungry. The chili is ready, I can smell it. And I'm trying to be good and not order in again. Um, but let me know what you think about the schedule change, which is Mornings is talk show with Cypher, um, or Coffee with Cypher. Evening, Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday is gaming, and nothing on Sunday, Monday, unless I do a random stream or get a stream gift or something, and then I'll do a un quick unboxing. Um, but Sundays is all about tabletop. Sunday I am on Rivals Waterdeep. Our season finale is this weekend. Please come watch and hang out and tell D&D how much you like our stream and our show. We are getting a third season. We'll be on a little bit of a break because of the holidays. Um, so don't go anywhere. We're going we're gonna to go give Misty some love. She's baking cookies. Um, so we're going to raid. Oops, that's not the right word. Um, raid Imperial Girl. And we also unlocked a new emote today. Yes, it is. Um, rivals. Oh, socks beat me to it. 
Um, and we do a podcast, and it is on the D and D um, is on the D and D official Twitch channel. So I'm gonna give you the the stream end, <laughs> and we're gonna go give Misty some love, and uh, see you over there for some delicious cookies. Uh, oh, the raid call, which would help. So let me do that while I change over to the end screen, because I gotta turn off the fucking fade in. All right, stream overlay. Are we are we doing this? Yes, there we go. <laughs> Um, I gotta figure out the fade in, fade out. So hopefully this will actually go. Yay, credits enrolled! You're so welcome. So no evening stream today. Here is your raid call. Use your high emote if you're a subscriber. No, it's totally fine, Sentai. Uh, so I am back on Monday. I may do a stream Monday because I have been gone a couple days. Or if my internet is good enough, I'll try to do a short stream tomorrow. Um, so yeah, let me, and also let me know what you think of the new overlay. This is in Stream Elements. Um, stream Elements, we unlocked a new emote today. Oh, it auto, <laughs> it auto rated Misty. Amazon, Amazon stop, stop, I know, right? Yes, I go, leave me, 